Jesus, this gun. Oh boy. So today on why does this gun exist, we're looking at an LMG called the Gorgon. And if you look at the description of it, it says it's a two-shot kill for an LMG. Why? Why does this gun exist? So the first clips you saw were only with the grip attachment, and now I've unlocked the rapid fire and extended mag for the bloody thing. I don't even want to know the results that this will have, but we're going to try out this overpowered monstrosity anyway. So let's go. This is a step-by-step -step of how to be a giant cock in multiplayer. What? How's this gun not nerfed? I mainly see this gun used in the Nuketown playlist for obvious reason, but otherwise it's kind of a situational gun. I mean, you can't exactly rush with it, which I think is what they sort of attempted with the low fire rate and the high power. But if you can find a place to head glitch or camp around, I, I don't even. This gun has to be nerfed soon, right? Like, really. I know other guns could be just as powerful, but this is a bit too much, I think. Can't say it's not fun to use, though. Also, on a side note, I'm not responsible for the messages you will most likely receive from using this gun. As if I'm the one who's told you to use it anyway, I mean, it's quite easy to find, it's not exactly a hidden gem. But you get the idea, it's stupidly powerful. This sort of LMG I would assume to be unlocked at like, maybe late 40, late level 40, maybe even end of prestige. But you unlock it quite early on, I think it's mid level 20s you unlock it, and I don't remember the exact number because I'm level 55 now, but it's pretty early on you unlock it, so you can't blame people for using it, but my god can it be abused, especially in Nuketown. So what do you guys think of this gun? I've already seen a lot of people fuming about being killed constantly by this thing, but if you think this is not a hard gun to go up against or don't think it's overpowered, then let me know. I call this to be nerfed at least within the next few weeks, I just feel it's way too powerful, but... I guess we'll see. Otherwise, this wraps up this video. This is the starting point of Black Ops 3 upload, so I hope all who are subscribed for Destiny videos aren't too disappointed. I haven't stopped playing it or anything, and I don't plan to stop making Destiny videos either. Until next time, thank you for watching.